Hi, I'm Patty James, and I'm the choreographer for ETC's Hands on a Hard Body. Well, Patty started out here in Cincinnati, born and raised, and um, I've always been a dancer. I'm a choreographer and a, a teacher at CCM. I've been there over 15 years, and luckily, Lynn Myers hired me for Mac and Mabel, and I cannot tell you what year that started, but from then on, we've been a, I, I hope she considers a, us a great team when it comes to musicals. Lynn called me in and said, look, I want to do this show, and it's about a truck, it's all about a truck, and um, so I virtually came in to look at the space that she had, and um, so she asked me, can you really, can we do this? And I said, sure, we can do, we can do this. This is, this will be a great challenge for us, but yes, we can do this. And then it was, it was fun because when the actual truck arrived and got on the set, she looked at me and said, can we do this? And I kind of went, I think we're going to have to do this now that we have this truck. They say there's 15 cast members and I always say, there's a 16 really, and it's, an, and it's a big red truck. The process started from the very beginning. I mean, we had to basically start from the front of the book, where sometimes you don't necessarily do that as a choreographer. I might take a big number in the middle and work it, but with this one, you really had to start with the very beginning number, the first number, and then work from there, because once they're on that truck, you can't do anything till you know where they're gonna be the next time you start up a number or or um, you know another scene. The challenge was not only to move them, but move them with a purpose, so that it makes sense when they are traveling from one person to another to ask them questions or just to talk to them. That it it looks natural and that it's not forced. That we have to just go to point A to point B. And I think you'll find that that after a while it. It doesn't bother you that they're keeping their hands on, it just looks natural. And I think that's one of the wonderful things about this show is that it was a great challenge for me. It gave me something to work around, to work for, to work on. In, in the beginning it was for the cast too, but once they got into their characters and they knew their lines, um, they, just, they just went with it. They're, they're wonderful. We're very lucky to have uh, some very talented cast members in the show. I think that people will leave with, with the sense of hope, that there is hope for everybody out there, and that's what this story is all about. All these characters, every single one of these 10 characters has a reason for being there, and, um, and you find that out throughout the story. And I'm sure that everybody out there in the audience will connect some way to somebody's story or know somebody in that situation and realize that, um, they were coming with hope and leaving with hope. And um, especially nowadays, this is a, it's, a, it's a great thing to leave with, is, is that the story of that there is, there is hope out there and we can make it through this. <laughs>